Welcome back. You know, we all know Michigan roads are pretty bad. Everyone talks about it. But what about our bridges tonight? 13 on your side reporter Sarah Makuda joins us and takes us on kind of a road trip all across West Michigan to examine the condition of our bridges. They're in pretty bad shape. You think they're in pretty bad shape, yeah. and I think that that's potentially what all of the viewers are thinking. Yeah. But I don't want to give it all away. Okay. It's not exactly the case. Well, you not interviewed exactly. a chief engineer from MDOT about yes. um, how a bridge is actually rated and how they determine just how bad they are. What did you discover? So the rating system is actually, so it's rated from um, a poor condition mm -hmm. to, well, there's like there's poor and then there's uh, like the closing potential. But okay. the rating scale, it, the way they determine if a bridge is labeled to be poor condition or right. in good fair condition, I was kind of surprised. It doesn't take a lot to push that rating scale to the bottom. Really? Yes, you would think that it would take more to, to determine that a bridge was in that bad of, of a shape. But there are conditions. They, they examine the bridge in three specific parts. I'm going to break that down for our viewers tonight okay. and um, get a good look at some of the bridges in West Michigan. I was, I was very surprised. I didn't know what to expect when I set out to examine the bridges. And I was very intrigued. And I think people are really gonna, are going to be informed. And you found, you found one that was in pretty bad shape, though. Yes, and we've talked about it here. Uh, we've talked about this bridge in particular. Right. It's an it's the Ferrysburg Bridge okay. in um, Ferrysburg, right. Michigan. Right. It's a very small population there, and that bridge is officially closed. Oh. People can no longer drive over it because it's in such bad condition. So we're going to talk about how much it would cost to actually replace that bridge, right. which is a big, big number, yeah. and kind of weigh out is it worth it to is replace it such a bridge if it's yeah. worth to replace it or, right. or not. Well, Ferrisburg is such a small population, you know, know, it's really a thought of like, well, how much money is worth pumping it into, you know, to those people. Granted, it's an important bridge to yeah. them, but in the overall picture, if there's so many bridges that need to be replaced, is it worth it to put that much money there? Because so much attention, deservedly so, is put into our roads, but yes. oftentimes we don't think about our, our infrastructure with the bridges. And yes. you're going to look into that tonight at yes. 6 o'clock, right? Definitely. All right, you can see Sarah's full report tonight at 6 on 13 on your side. I can't wait because I think a lot of people are going to be surprised and, and maybe, you know, very surprised at what you discovered in your report. I absolutely agree. All right, thank okay. you, Sarah. We look forward to it. Yeah, thank you.